Hi viewers, we are back with our new video. In this video, we speak about social media awareness. Social media is a powerful medium to propagate information. There is good entertainment and many true users. But not everyone you meet in a virtual world is a saint. There are fraudsters and even cyber criminals. While sharing private information of viewers, think twice. Your photo or video you share can impact your image even your daily life. While sharing private information of viewers, like location, residential address, or your personal phone number, or any contact information, make sure you are sharing with it only your trusted people. And also be aware with who you are getting connected. Avoiding someone who is not possibly your friend is a act of security and not rudeness. Precisely saying that when you accept request only from a known and trusted person, you are guaranteeing security for yourself. Problem solved. Know your privacy options. When you are not considering the previously mentioned points and sharing something recklessly, keep in the mind that you are allowing netizens only bad and shameless one to steal your information. If you ask who will steal my information and what they do with it. Ask yourself how much easier it is to create a fake social media account with your info and get connected and can your friends in my perceptions very easier than ordering a pizza information is very strong of man it, it can benefit you if it is and fail and in good hands but what happen if that not the case it's not a funny it is very serious also knowing your privacy options and securing your information from others is always the best practice keep yourself updated on various privacy actions like profile pictures, gods, only friends option, etc. Different social media sites provide different security options. Everyone must take time to explore them and secure your information. It's for your own good. Number 3. Passwords and Websites While choosing a password for your account, make sure no one guesses it. While few accounts like financial sites, and websites, etc. help in making strong passwords while creation of accounts but some not. Few of the bets used frequently for online frauds are websites, links and money. What? Websites? Yes. While searching for a website, we all could possibly select from the option provided by the searcher. But do you know there is a threat of redirecting you to the fake websites which could steal your information? Observe this URL. What's carefully? It's not Facebook, it's Facebook. To prevent this, make sure you type the web URL completely by yourself or be alert by selecting the options from the drop down. Same goes for the links. Do not click open the links that look suspicious. When your mail or browser notifies you about the malicious content, consider it. Experts say that while using apps on your PC or mobile phone, you can always track where is your information is getting passed using Northern Security Act. Let's not ignore all these points because it gets hard if sensitive information is dealt by wrong people. While spending time in knowing how to get more followers and how to get more likes, let's also consider the question how to keep my information safe. We have a request for our parents too. Due to lockdown, many of you provide your children with mobile phones for attending online classes. But make sure you monitor what they are watching and what website they are visiting. One of the true incidents happens in Coimbatore was a case of a child abuse of a 11 year old girl. And that incident happens because the culprit whose age was around 15 to 17 were not properly monitored by their parents. Their parents were not aware that their children were visiting age restricted website and their carelessness lead to the continuous sexual abuse of 11 year old child for about a week. 
not only child abuse but there are few other cases registered on accessing and emptying the bank account for gaming so we request parents to monitor their children and keep them away from restricted website net banking mails etc never save your password anywhere password protect your mobile and laptop and always check the search history it's important to be aware of what your kids do online but snooping can alienate them and damage the trust we have built together the key is to stay involved in a way that makes your kids understand that you respect their privacy or want to make sure they are safe mean behavior is not okay so make it clear that you expect your kids to treat others with respect and to never post harmful or embarrassing messages and ask them to always tell you about any harassing or bullying messages from others consider making a social media agreement with your kids in which they agree to protect their own privacy consider their reputation and not give out any personal information about them they also pr- promise not to use technology to hurt anyone else through threatening bullying or gossiping in turn parents agree to respect teens privacy while making an effort to be part of the social media world by friending them and observing them parents can also can help keep kids grounded in the real world by putting limits on media use so keep computers in public areas in the house avoid laptops and smartphones in bedrooms and set some rules on the use of technology